My name is Jason Woodside. I'm a painter. I moved to New York City when I was 17, 16, 17, and um, started creating art. I approach public art in a way that's not super figurative. It's obviously very abstract, but um, the ideal sort of outcome is, is positivity. You know, kids that walk by and they get inspired to create something, I think that's kind of the goal. It's crazy when you when you put a, a piece on the wall and how much it actually transforms the neighborhood a little bit. You really get a great response to the community. If I'm doing it, then they can do it, you know? And that's the beauty of art is that everybody creates their own. I don't plan any of the pieces that I do. I don't plan them until I actually get there and kind of see the landscape and, and the people and the culture. I'd like to paint on a plane. <laughs> More transportation based and anything to enlighten that sort of travel. A lot of the inspiration was nature elements, the ocean and the light. It's very literal. So I think when I created this piece, I was, you know, the, obviously dealing with the element of water. I think it touches a lot on just the, the general movement of water and, and how dimensional it is in the sense that there's so many different elements of light and color that come out of moving water. It's so inspiring for me to look at. I'm pretty specific with the brands that I choose to, to align with. It has to be on a genuine level, and I feel like the progressive outlook that this brand has was kind of the right direction. To work with a company that does give you the canvas, to give you the opportunity to be on a global scale is, is special. When you go into a bodega and you see a radical piece of art on something that you're going to purchase, it's a cool part of your day. There's multi-levels of inspiration there, whether it's through hydration or the experience of picking up the bottle. It offers a, a visual aspect that it's definitely inspiring.